I finally, finally, finally got the Air Force I've been looking for. So, I'm going to show you them. This is what they look like. I basically paid like $120 for these, which means they're like £10 more than I would have paid in the UK. However, this is what they look like. Hazard's literally got these exact ones, and since she had them, I really, really liked them. Everywhere sells the normal Air Force that literally just have the tick, but I really like how this is like all like dropped down and stuff. So, I picked these up, and honestly, I'm so glad that I can finally wear shoes that aren't super heavy. So, I'm going to put these on, and then we're going to head to watch Spider-Man. Just to catch up to speed with what's happening. Basically, Ellen has woke up this morning and went to get the nails done. And we were gonna go to the cinema. Well, we are gonna go to the cinema and watch Spider-Man because it was released today, right? It came out today. It came out today. It came out today, the new Spider-Man. So we've come over to Universal to go watch it at the Universal Cinema. However, Haz and Ella are not gonna be done for like another hour. So we've come super, super early to Universal because we thought they'd be done a lot earlier than they are. And um, now we're just here for like an hour. So we're gonna walk around, go in a few shops and just see what the hell's happening around here, which is not too much. So obviously, it's a theme park, but we're gonna have a little wonder around and just um, hopefully they don't take the full hour because I am hungry and everything is so overpriced in here. Alright so we've just done some light shopping in Hot Topic. I literally got a Billie Eilish t-shirt and it is so so cool. I wanted to get the hoodie but it was like $60 and I really didn't want to pay that. It was a really really cool hoodie but I got the same exact print. Well a similar print. It's from the same like collection of merch but just in the t-shirt version just to like you know what I'm not paying $60 for a hoodie. Especially when we're in LA like I wouldn't be able to wear it until I'm home. But it was really cool. It had like flames and dice and stuff on it and it was like black and green. It's similar to the t-shirt, but I wish the t-shirt had the dice on because it would be really, really cool. Anyway, we are now just waiting around this area. I think we're going to go and try and find some food from somewhere because the guy's still on here. Like, they're still getting the nails done. Ella takes me asking for the address of this place, so I reckon they are looking to book an Uber, but I don't know where they are or how far away they are, so I don't want to stay around and not eat and then them get here and be like, let's go to the cinema straight away because I am literally starving. I have had no breakfast today. Well, that's the situation. We're just sort of walking around Universal and we're coming back on Wednesday as well, so like, we're going to be here like twice this week. I literally just got out of the cinema now. It was so, so good, like, honestly. I'm not, like, a super massive fan of Spider-Man. It's not my favourite of the Marvel, like, what would you even call it? It's not my favourite, like, Marvel film. However, that went literally insane. I was always kind of salty that Tom Holland was the new Spider-Man. I actually loved... I forgot his name now. I'm such a fake fan. It's going to come to me as soon as I end this clip. But I loved the original Peter Parker so much that when they got Tom Holland to do it, I was like, hmm, no. But he really does do it justice. Like, he's really fucking incredible. The film is insane. The cinema we watched in actually is insane as well. We literally were laid down. We were front row, but we were like laid down. The sofas were like big ass leather, reclining sofas. I so wish I could have filmed the so just the cinema in general. It was the bougiest cinema I've ever been to in my entire life. It was so so cool. What we paid. Those seats are incredible. They're like they're better than the yeah they're better than the VIP that we have in the UK. And we paid for like we worked out basically what you'd pay to see a film in the UK. However, we were in like these incredibly big like bougie seats, but reclined the entire way back. The film. Was Incredible, the cinema are incredible. I now I'm just incredible. like, Sand. yeah, Zendaya. Hi, how are you? I don't know what the little fleckles of like light are on my camera, it's a bit of dust stuck in my lens. Yeah, I don't know what we're doing. There's nothing to do around here apart from Universal. Anyway, I'll update you when we uh, actually do something, but that's the situation. Um, so yeah, this is what happens apparently after you go and see Spider-Man, you come to Target. I don't even know why we're here. I've been trying to find, since we got here, some like, what would you even call it, like a champagne popper, like a long party popper that you twist at the bottom and it explodes with confetti like a big ass one. Because for my 100k video, I really wanted to end it by me popping one of those. My 100k video is the dumbest thing ever, but I've been waiting to find one of those. I thought we'd find a party city, but the party city is like miles and miles away, so we've not ended up being in that area and I don't want to trek everyone in an Uber all the way there just to get a party popper. So, I found these in Target. I don't know if I can buy them. I'm pretty sure I can. It's only party poppers, but we'll wait and see. But um, hopefully we can. Fingers crossed. I don't know what we're actually looking for. Everyone's just got crisps and toilet roll so far, so nothing too exciting. This angle is literally like a tragedy. Hi you guys, so I'm gonna show you what's in me for today's video. It's actually a porn star angle. Right, I'm gonna show you what I got from Hot Topic. It's in this tiny ass little bag, but I um, got a Billie Eilish t-shirt, like I mentioned, and I think it's really, really cool. So, the great reveal, three, two, one. Ta da It reminds me of the um, Speed Hunters Balenciaga one, so. Thought I'd pick it up, you know, really cool, really fun, really fresh. How's do you like it? Oh yeah, oh god, I really like that though. Thanks, sis, I'm gonna try it on now for all you girlies. I'm gonna get my boobies out. It's not mine. And try it on. That's what it looks like. I think it's really, really cool. Kind of wish I got a bigger size though, not gonna lie. So 
So this morning, Freya's got like a little spinny fan thing. And I accidentally broke it and Anna just dogged me in. Do my accent, this is the funny part. Don't tell Freya. Don't tell Freya. Why'd you give me that accent? That sounds like slightly Indian, not gonna lie. It does. I don't mean it to be. You went, don't tell Freya. Why do I talk like that? I literally told you I would. Imagine if I go like, don't tell Freya. Anyway, good morning everyone. It's the start of the vlog. So we're currently at Westfield, so we've never been here before. The little skinny mini escalator as well, we love that. But we basically, we've come to Westfield on Santa Monica because we're gonna go here, go shopping, have some food and then we're gonna walk down Santa Monica Beach, get the scooters and then scooter to Venice Beach. But we've always come to Westfield because obviously we're always in Westfield in the UK. So why not make it feel like we're at home, you know? Can confirm the food court here is so much nicer than the <laughs> London one. I don't imagine if the London food court were like this. It literally feels like we're in like Greece or some shit. Wow. Right, so we've come into Shake Shack for his dinner. Look how nice this looks. I'm so excited. I've dropped it all down there. Why do I do that with everything I eat? Right, we've finished up in Shake Shack and as you can see, Anastasia's now by my side because the main channel video has started, so... In the rest of this vlog, Anastasia's gonna be stood next to me annoyingly, Everyone's but... Gonna love it. You know what, at least I'll get the clout in. <laughs> this vlog's gonna get views in! Anyway, we're just literally shopping around Westfields now. We've come into H&M. I don't really know what the plans are, I don't know what stores they have here or anything, but we're just walking around, you know? Hang just as normal, you know, natural, natural environment. We're now on Venice Beach, just gonna walk along the beachfront. I want a drink and I want a snack because I'm starving. But um, this is the current situation, you know? Us two are gonna stick together today. literally just scooted all the way from Venice, all the way through to Santa Monica, where we went the other day shopping. I had Anna on the back of me the entire way, and we didn't crash, so look out so for fun. us. They were really, really good. I'm exhausted, but that was so much fun. Get a good enough grip on the road. 